Okay, hi everybody. Welcome back to our groovy life. So tonight, yes. Gabby and I are trying, we've been trying a lot of different beefy sticks, or what we call beefy sticks. So tonight though, we're trying, we're gonna kick it up a little bit and going back to our roots of hot and spicy. Hot and spicy. <laughs> uh, so yeah, so a few things that uh, we're gonna try tonight. Three things that are uh, generally throughout the world of beefy sticks, these would be called shorties, I guess. So three of them we're gonna try tonight. Clements, hot snack sticks. We're not eating all of these. We're no, just gonna try one tonight. One. Of the uh, one mahi, I'm not that hungry. Right, the one mahi, <laughs> not mahi, mahi. One, smokehouse sausage sticks. These are uh, from Bridgeford, and they're the hot and spicy recipe. And then, from Duke's, the hot and spicy smoked shorty sausages. So all of them I would call shorties, and all of them should be fantastic. So Gavin and I are going to give them a try. And uh, if they're all really, really good, they might end up in Bloody Mary's later. Here we are back. So they're open, ready to go. So let's cut some pieces off. Like this is the Clements Hot Stick. This is the Bridgeford Hot and Spicy Smokehouse Sausage Stick. And then the Duke's Hot and Spicy Shorty Sausages. All right, let's see what we think. Woo! Oh. Dropped it. The Clemens soup is very tasty. A lot of seasoning to it. Oh, mm -hmm. that had a little bit of a kick. Mm-hmm. Clemens is an awesome awesome Ooh. company that's spicy but mm -hmm. they're from milwaukee <laughs> wisconsin the i top. lived there for for several years of my life and always loved clement's products when i was there here locally we get them through menards since menards, menards. is a uh, is a wisconsin company as well so they sell clement's product uh, but wow just a great product very tasty they, they're sweet they have some sweetness and they have a little bit of a kick to definitely them. Definitely a little bit of a kick. It caught me in the back of my throat, but mm -hmm. yeah, definitely very, some sweet. Very tasty. Really, really good. Okay, so the Bridgeford smoked a smokehouse sausage sticks, hot and spicy. These guys here will try so those. These next. two look dry. That one's like mm -hmm. red. Yeah, the Bridgeford and the Dukes are much more dry than the Clements. Well, you can just see that here. Oh. I get no hot and spicy. No, there's no heat mm -mm. at all. This one was more spicy than the last one. Yeah, yeah no, I don't get any. Maybe a it's little, little bit of... It's got a nice little flavor, though. Yeah, maybe a little bit of black pepper. But yeah, great flavor. Not, not hot and spicy at all, but mm. great flavor. Really good. I like that one. That one's really good. It's not over the top. Where is Bridgeford from? I know that we've had Bridgeford product before. They're from Chicago, Illinois. Huh. I did not know that. It's good. Baron Bridgeford Jr. I like that one. Yeah, it was really good. It's really tasty. It's not, again, not spicy at all, but it would be fabulous, again, in a Bloody Mary and... Uh, I'd put this one in a Bloody Mary. Yeah. So far, this is the one I'd pick. Yeah, that one's really tasty. This one kind of makes me nervous. Look how red that is. Yeah, it is. We'll see. Like, it's so, super red. Oh, so here's the Duke's oh. Hot and Spicy. We're going to give this one a shot. Serrano peppers. Okay, it's made with serranos. I like serranos. Serranos are just a little bit north of Jalapeno on the Scoville scale. I got nothing from that one. I think this one's... There's a little bit there. There's a little bit there. I didn't get that much. No? Mm -hmm. Where are they from? Also from Chicago, Illinois. Interesting. I really like that... What is this one? Bridgeful? Bridgeful? Bridgeford. 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 I really like that one. That one's yeah. really good. I would eat that one out of all... Out of, I was going to say margarita. So the Duke's uses 
What is fresh that? serrano, fresh never frozen pork, cherry wood smoke. Wow. Yeah, they're really, oh my gosh. I don't even know how I would pick between these three. Personally, they're just, all three of them are just phenomenal. I, high class, high quality products. Oh, now that you eat this one after you eating another one, that one does. This one does have a little bit of a zip, but again, it's not over the top. Mm -hmm. Like how we like our spicy Bloody Marys, that would be a nice garnish for it. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Yeah, those are all just amazing. Yeah, it does have. There's a little bit of a. There's a little bit of a kick, not back over the of the top. mouth zine. Yeah. Nothing quite, but actually a little bit of black not pepper. Not over the maybe. top. It's really good. I was really nervous about this, this Duke's is... one because it's red. Yeah, it doesn't, uh, pork, beef, sea salt, chopped parsley, cane sugar, natural flavor, spices, of course they always say that. Spices. Vinegar, <laughs> roasted garlic, and red pepper. Now, you know what, I couldn't possibly choose. Like I mentioned, this fabulous product out of Wisconsin, a little bit, it's a, it's a softer, more moist, it's very beefy sweet. stick. We call everything a beefy stick if you <laughs> haven't noticed. I know that there's some pork mix in some, and sometimes even turkey. Uh, this guy, much, much drier, as is, I would even say the Dukes is more dry than the Grizzly. But, uh, oh my gosh. This one just looks oh. like it's much drier. Mm -hmm. That looks just like a piece of beef jerky compared to this one. Wow. I really like this one. Can you cut me just, I just want yep. just a little bit. I don't want a whole thing. They're all really, really high quality. Nothing that's going to burn your face by any means, mm -hmm. just fabulous treats. Like we said, like Gabby and I said, Bloody Marys, or just a, you know what, I just need to have a little bit of a, of a zip. zip with a beautiful beefy stick. That's what I've done a couple nights, I was like, I want something spicy. And I've gone after a couple of our spicy pickles, but you know, this definitely could be added to the warm oh uh, Yeah, this is awesome. So all three of them are great. So yeah. I'm not even sure what else to tell you all. You all need to uh, to try them. Uh, tell us below what your favorite is, if you have a favorite. But uh, but all three uh, of these businesses and families have, are making great product. They're just fabulous. Absolutely. Um, but let us know what your favorite is. Or if you have something where you say, hey, Derek and Gabby, great, love that. But uh, hey, have you tried ours from our town? Yeah, we would let us love know. to do that. We would love to do that because we love this kind of product. Absolutely. Let us know down below. Yeah, if you guys have an opinion, about if you guys have had these before, let us know. Or if you guys have any like shout outs, like of course there's going to be a lot of different brands that we haven't tried, but like let right. us know. We would love to we're try. We're always them. down to try more stuff. We would love to try them. So that said, great. Thanks everybody for stopping by. We'll see you see next you time. Soon. Bye.